Hi Bob, this is an open letter to you to discuss my disappointment in the purchase of one of your T3B guitars. I have two issues. One is a design fault in the case, and the other is an act of butchery carried out on the volume potentiometer. Firstly the case. The design of the case fails on two counts. One, the centre of gravity of the case when it's lying on its side is not centred between the feet of the case. This causes the case to tend to fall to the right, which it is quite happy to do. Secondly, the guitar is not supported on its back or its front. The designers of the case went to the trouble of adding padding to the bottom of the case and the lid of the case. The trouble is that neither of these pads actually touch the guitar. This is a case design failure. For all practical purposes, they might as well not even be there. Now comes the fun part, Bob. When the case does fall over, because there is no support for the guitar, the plastic button on the pickup selector switch is rammed into the lid of the case. This causes the button to be forced down with such force that the button is ruptured. The button ends up so low on the switch shaft that you cannot select either the bridge or neck pickups. It's jammed in the centre position. This is an engineering failure, Bob. This should not happen. Secondly, the volume potentiometer. I bought the guitar new from a tailor dealer whose manager swears that the guitar was perfect when it was dispatched to me. The first thing I noted was that the pickup selector button as described previously. The second thing I noted was that I was not able to split the bridge pickup. Upon investigation it is clear that someone has replaced the volume potentiometer switch and completely botched the job. Bob, this is a new guitar carrying your name. How can all these things happen? Given that no one has offered me any assistance with these issues, I have written this song to warn other guitar buyers that all is not right in Taylorland. Not happy, Bob. <laughs>